yo, 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 your boy is back with another Retro Bowl ready. Listen, man, rule number one, no racist, sexist, homophobic content. Now that it's been a while since I've done a Retro Bowl Reddit episode, man, I'm especially excited to do this episode because I have not seen any posts since Retro Bowl College came out. So I'm excited to see how many losers there are in this world that have been grinding that game way too long because you know that is the theme of these episodes, man. Who is not touching grass? As you can tell from the backdrop, I am not home. I am still in Urban, aka Japan. You know what I'm saying? Your boy's out here still checking in on the retro already. I'm gonna sort my top posts this month. Let's get into it. Playing against Michigan and notice my receivers' routes are perfectly covered each time. Almost as if the defense knows the play beforehand. Only happens against Michigan. Anyone else encounter this glitch? You see, I actually encountered this glitch too. You know, it's very interesting. Uh, you know, I, I, when I was calling the play on the sideline, they were like, you guys might need to look at this one, you know what I'm saying? I actually saw some weird looking fans standing at the 50 yard line. And it seems like a lot of these comments agree with me. Look at this. Yeah, yeah. He sees a random Michigan colored fan show up at the 50. It's weird. They've been coming to my other games. It's kind of strange. I ain't gonna lie, but this definitely needs to be fixed. Hey, Simon, let's get on this one. I swear the post game after every big win. Coach, congrats on winning the championship. First question, what position does Johnson play? You know what they need to add on Retro Bowl though? They need to add like a Woj or like a Shams or like an Adam Schefter. I need an Ian Rappaport on Retro Bowl. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that reports the transactions that are happening around the league. That's what I need. Can you imagine all of a sudden one day Pat Zadol is shopping B Hall looking for a first round pick and return like the, the, the everybody would just freak out wow a huge thank you to everyone who has downloaded our games Regible College has now had more than 1.5 downloads give it up for that boy Bell Avenue Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at all of these dick riders, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Are those orphans going to win the major championship? The university asked me to cut my wide receiver after he drove through an orphanage. Defend player. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I'm doing the same thing. I can't lie. We need to win that goal. What a weirdo. The rest of the team is furious with Colonel Mauro. That's where he made everyone listen to the latest LGBT podcast before the game. Instead of the usual pump up music mix. Is this real? Wait, this can't be real, right? Is this actually in the game? I'm gay and I think this is funny. Oh no, it's in the game, ladies and gentlemen. My ranking system. Yo, what is this? I've seen a lot of posts that comment on the issues and rankings in the game, so I thought I would share. The demonstration is based on the 2022 college football season through week 12. Bro, get a job! Touch some grass! What is this? Real life simulation. What is he cooking? Okay, so this is a top 25 ranking. Why did he do this on paper? What is this? I don't even know what he's writing. I don't even know where to start here. Plus 25, plus 30. RP? Bro, what? I'm, I'm so confused. Why did this guy do this with pencil and paper? What is this third page? Oh my god, this guy came up with a whole ranking system for college retro bowl. Just off his dome. Off his mind. Off of straight willpower. FBS. FCS. Unranked FBS. Just, just everything. That's worse than the years. I'm not gonna lie. That might be the worst thing I've ever seen on this Retro Bowl Reddit. I can't lie. Somebody bully him, please, man. You're gonna lose your mind when you find out about Excel. Well done, my autistic brethren. <laughs> You're on the spectrum. <laughs> All right, let's let's just keep it moving, man. That that's the worst post so far. Amir Line has asked to miss the next training session to study for his drawing drawing test. How do you study for a drawing test? Do you just start scribbling? Start grinding? I, I would never allow this studying. No. My five-year-old daughter likes to play games on my phone while we wait for school to start. This morning, she took interest in Retro Bowl and wanted to play. I didn't realize how easy it was to delete a game profile. So today, I said goodbye to over a hundred seasons of play. I think we need to relieve this guy out of all parental duties. I think we need to put the kid up for adoption. I think she needs new parents. That is absolutely insane. Have you tried restoring the file? Oh God, here we go. Have you tried restoring the file? Potentially, it can recover your file back if you choose to code the algorithm correctly. All right, sounds like he got his file back though. Shout out to the daughter. Why am I shouting out a five-year-old? That's so weird. But before we get into the rest of the video, I gotta say ho, ho, ho. 
Merry Christmas. It's the Christmas season, and what better way to ring in the holiday season than to play on DraftKings Casino, America's number one casino. Santa Jefe is back partnering with DraftKings Casino to bring you one of the greatest presents you can receive this holiday season. $100 in DraftKings Casino credits. DraftKings is offering $100 in casino credits to any new customers that plays with $5 or more. With over 300 real money games such as slots, roulette, blackjack, and exclusive DraftKings games, you could be happier than everybody behind me. If casino isn't available in your state, you can also check out DraftKings' daily fantasy app where you can win cash prizes all season long. But most importantly, DraftKings is safe, secure, and reliable. So I want you guys to download and head to the DraftKings Casino app right now, sign up with my promo code HEFEZAI, and unwrap the holiday seasons with DraftKings Casino. Thank you to DraftKings for sponsoring this video. I'm about to go spread the word and tell everybody about the code. You know what I'm saying? Enjoy the rest of the video. I saw a post with 214 points, so I decided to blow that out of the water. 416. Now, this is Photoshop. Ain't no way, bro. Man, this just gave me an idea for a thumbnail. Yeah, you probably already seen the video. This is gonna be my thumbnail for next video. Fans are punks. Why are fans such punks? All right, here we go. Hold on, let me get some water for this. I feel like this guy is about to say something stupid. So I'm just gonna prepare myself. I'm gonna hydrate. I'm playing as friggin' Cal State San Luis Obispo. The damn banana slugs for crying out loud. Lose one game and the fan base drops 15%. Well, it may seem like you're not a good coach. Have you met football fans? That's a very good point. See, don't get me started with my Niners right now. All right, we were 5-0. and We lose one game. I started flipping out. Now, you guys are lucky that I'm not live streaming this year and I'm not doing game reactions no more because I'm moving from place to place here in Japan. But if I was back home, my God. What is the best defensive scheme? I simulated 23 years in Retrieval to find out. Ooh, wait till you see the... Okay. <laughs> oh you know what? I'm actually kind of interested in this. This is a good hook. Ho oh my days. Bro tried every single combination with defensive players to determine what the best defense on Retrieval is. Look at he and he provided picture proof. Oh my god, he maxed out everything. Yeah, this guy actually has no job. He's unemployed. He has no life. He does not know the feel of grass. He does not know the smell of fresh air. This guy does not know anything in life. He's probably never even been to a Shake Shack, man. This guy has not lived life, man. This guy's just playing at home, running his retro bowl game. Let me just read the conclusion. Having D-line gives you more sacks, likely at the cost of more turnovers. Linebacker DB defenses are probably superior for creating turnovers. Further testing with more specific schemes are needed no i don't i don't think you need further testing. i think the only thing that needs further testing is your life choices i think you need to further test employment you need to further test on indeed.com and then bro hit me with the fun facts and things i noticed oh my god so this man wrote his hypothesis then he wrote his mistakes this is actually structured like a school paper then he provided the empirical data to back up his facts and then he hit me with the results conclusions and fun facts oh my god what are the comments saying please bully him yes well done I respect it, bro. Not quite a lung doc. You got it, man. You know what? I'm gonna try it. I might, I might read that on my off time. Because my defense on Regible College has been struggling. So I might try your stuff out, man. How am my defense giving 52 points? Hey, man, you need to read not quite a long doc. You got to read this. Wide receiver draft steal of the century. Whoa. Cordy Drake. One and a half star rating. Round three pick with five star potential. Wait, that's actually crazy. I've never seen something like this. This is why you scroll the Retro Bowl Reddit. Kind of reminds me of me back in my playing days. You know what I'm saying? When I was playing uh, college football, you know, I really had a one and a half star rating. Unfortunately, you guys, I tore my ACL, so I couldn't really continue. You know what I mean? Or else I would be in the league right now, torching up your favorite DBs. But yeah, I had five star potential too, bro. But you know, you gotta give me time. You gotta give me till I'm 45. They didn't let me play like Tom Brady. You feel me? They gave me time, you know? I'll be on the bills right now. You feel me? Which Retro Bowl teams do you start with most? What the hell is this? Frequency of retrable starting teams. Yo, I swear only like data analytics, data scientists play this game. Cause what is happening? When you don't select start with favorite team. Okay, so you only get a chance at 17 teams. Interesting, data from a hundred new game starts. This guy clicked new game a hundred times. Oh my God. All right, original retrable. Let's take a look. So you most likely start with Arizona, Houston, Las Vegas. Number of wins. Three, two, four, one, five, and six. So you can't get a seven win team. I swear I've inherited like an eight win team before. Maybe I'm tripping. Have y'all inherited a seven win team before? I swear. I mean, he's only done a hundred. So maybe his research isn't 
to a T. It isn't complete, but this is the graph right here, man. Why is it a 1% chance to get the Jets or the Washington Commanders? Like, come on, that's gotta be up. Those teams are worse than some of the teams up here. Miami 1%? If you can start off with Miami, that'd be fine. How would you improve vegetable college? All right, more negativity. Let's see, fix the color. Hmm. For example, I played an out-of-conference game versus IU and their crimson jerseys were straight up orange. My team is GT and instead of gold, it's highlighter yellow. Red shirting. Have the option to red shirt a player. Yes, I like this. You find a two-star recruit with a lot of potential, but you have a junior or senior already slotted to start. Why not be able to recruit that player and be given the option to red shirt something? That's a fact. Man, I'm reading nice today, man. I don't know what it is. Did my English improve while I'm in Japan? This is kind of crazy. Hold on. Wait a minute, man. I'm flowing transfers. Have a transfer portal and include guys from other teams that were cut slash left and have developed more, but have less up Side. You can still include them in the recruiting process just with them only being available for one to three years depending on when they transfer. What other ideas do you have? Oh my god, the words are flowing out of my mouth. But yes, I agree. Transfer portal needs to be added on Retrobol. I don't know why they didn't include it. That is like seems like the next major feature. Maybe they left it out. Maybe they pulled the EA. They should have just added the transfer portal from day one. But you know what? I, I, I don't blame them. You know what I'm saying? Maybe when they add the transfer portal, more players start playing. You know what I'm saying? I see, I see how it is, man. You start getting that I see. I like it though. Let me know in the comments down below. How would y'all improve Retrobol College, man? I'm interested to hear y'all's opinions. Retro Bowl Law Firm. If you're a student athlete, uh, come here and I'll talk you out of cutting or suspending. The athletes need representation and I'm here to make sure they have a voice. We have a RBCPA. Wow. I'm the coach of Ohio State and my five-star quarterback allegedly murdered several elderly people after having a beer or two and driving his monster truck into the local soup kitchen which the owner is several months behind on his rent. So who's the real criminal? Someone stealing from landowners or just a kid who was having a little fun? How do y'all come up with these scenarios in your head? Like, where does this creativity, where does this... This, this specialness come from. And then the choice to put this on the internet. Like where, where does this, where does the ideas come from? Why do they let their GPAs hit zero? Why? You gotta get your ass in there and pay the teachers. Facts. Keep an eye on them when they dip below 2.0. This is sound legal advice, actually. Monitor your players' grades. Teachers are always ready to play ball if you pay them. I agree. We gotta make sure we have enough funding to pay the teachers off, man. I I'm with this law firm right here. All right, y'all. I think that's gonna do it, man. I think I've seen enough posts for today. Hopefully I have. I didn't want to spend too long looking at retrobol Reddit posts because I am not home. I'm in Japan. Let me know in the comments down below, man. Let me know what y'all think of this video, man. Let me know how y'all would improve Retro College. Shout out to New Star Games once again for releasing the game. I appreciate y'all for watching, man. And your boys out. Konichiwa. That means hello. I don't know why I said that.